Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Miss Lorraine Lee 11 and today I'm going to be showing you how I got this revamped twist out and an old twist out. Okay, so all I use guys, I spritz my hair with a slight bit of water just to make it damp. And then I use, as you've seen in my previous video, the As I Am Long and Lux Curl Enhancing Smoothie. And the reason why I used this is because it states, it says delivers high definition twists and twist out styles that are smooth, soft and shiny. So I thought, why not? This isn't what I originally used for my twist out, but I thought for this time around, I'm gonna use it. So this isn't a talking video guys, I'm just gonna go ahead, just show you how these twists look and uh, yeah. It's way too easy to say stuff I never do You know it's not how I feel, baby Don't care what we'll let this slide Can't stop to see you cry Come on, little mouse, if there's something I have to say I love you when I hate you and I hope you feel the same Come on, little mouse, baby, please don't walk away I love you when I, yeah Okay, so this is what I've got so far. As you can see, I've got a lot of frizz on the ends, but that's fine. So first of all, I'm going to stretch it with the hairdryer, and then I'm gonna show you what I do to eliminate some of this frizz, okay? Okay guys, so before I go ahead and um, start stretching my hair with the hairdryer, I do wanna say the reason why I got most of this frizz is because my hair was in a flat twist out. So basically, because I'm having to unravel, it's almost like unraveling cane row, because I had to unravel the hair that was attached, to the flat cane row, then these are the end results, what I usually get on the end. If I'd done a normal single two strand twist, then this wouldn't happen, but it's fine. We're going to resolve it, don't worry. <laughs> so just carry on watching. Okay guys, so I think that's stretched enough and I'm happy with the shape. So what I'm gonna do guys, hopefully if you do this twist out and you don't get these results, then you can just leave it there. But as I've got frizz on the end, I'm going to just little bits like these. I'm just gonna go back in and kind of recoil them. And what I'm gonna use to recoil them is my friendly tub of Eco Styler. Now, obviously, you've got to know how to apply this correctly, otherwise your hair will start to look wet. 
but because I know Eco Styler curls my hair up straight away and I've tried this before I know I'm gonna get a good result so let me just start by going in like this so you see this piece as you can see I've got a nice curl now and go for another piece that looks frizzy And it might look like scraggly bits at first, but obviously you scrunch them in and it was set that way. Okay. So you don't want to overdo it with gel, guys, because you don't want your hair to start going all wet like a wash and go. You just want to recurl these frizzy parts like this, if you can see that. Okay, so we just want to recurl those. So basically you want them just to clump together. And when you've got your clump, you kind of just scrunch it up and just leave it be. Okay guys, so as you can see, I'm getting some type of curl there. A bit more definition. So I'm just going to scrunch these curls up. And I'm just going to go back in with the hair dryer. You can go with a diffuser, but I'm not using the diffuser part. I'm just going to use the nozzle as it is because I don't want to manipulate the curls or the twist out too much. I just want to literally dry these parts. So there you go, got a nice little ringlet there. And then, oh, see, it's hanging. But as it, as it starts to dry, guys, it will start to shrink up. As you can see, as I said, it's shrunken up now and it's really curled up nicely. There you go. And that is it. So I'm gonna go ahead and do the other side. So this, as you can see, it's still shiny because it's wet, but it will dry up nicely, guys. And then I'm gonna go ahead, do this side quickly off camera and I'll come back to you. Okay, guys, so there you go. I've got my ends to get curly again. So my hair is still in the drying process. That's why it's got a bit of a hang, but as the gel starts to dry, it will shrink up a bit more. As you can see a bit on this side so I do like this shape that I've got but that's only guys it's only to rescue your curls okay. so there you have it guys this is if you just want to if you want to extend your twist out so I think I'm gonna extend this maybe for about a couple more days let's say because I do like the twist out okay guys if you have any questions don't hesitate to leave your comments and questions down below in the box down below <laughs> i will leave details of the product in the description box and that is it guys i will see you soon bye